the world's largest falls now down to a trickle in places. If we're not careful, we're going to lose this site entirely. We're going to lose this site entirely. Do me a favor, please. Get out of here. Get out of here, man. Shit, I'm saying. When are you going to stop changing the African narratives? When are you going to stop pushing the negative stereotypes about Mother Africa? Enough is enough. <laughs> this is one of the seven wonders of the world. This is the majestic, breathtaking Victoria Falls and it's not dry. My name is John Zulu mm -hmm. and I'm the site manager of the Victoria Falls World Heritage Site. Is the Victoria Falls dead? I'm sure as you have seen, it's rocking. It's not dead. How did you feel when the news circulated that Victoria Falls is dead? It was quite painful because and you could see the power of social media. media. How news, wrong news can easily just infiltrate the whole world and destroy the good image of a property or a site like this one here. Uh, one thing that uh, people fail to understand, especially mm. them that were capturing all that and narrating all those stories, mm. they fail to understand that the Victoria Falls is a unique site. Mm. One of the reasons why it was declared as a World Heritage Site, that was in 1989, it's because of its unique geological formation. Okay. Secondly, because of the geomorphological processes. And thirdly, because of its aesthetic beauty. Wow. That is why it was declared as a World Heritage Site. Yeah. Besides that, it's just one of the seven natural wonders of the world. Yeah. Okay. And it's an important bed space. So it's recognized all over the, the world, world because of those values. But besides that, Victoria Falls itself, it has got these two unique faces. It has got a high season, mm. water season, and it has got also a low water season. That enables you to see when you come, for instance, like now between mm -hmm. the months of July, August, September, October, November, and December, mm. you are able to see this unique rock formation. Sure. And the geomorphological processes themselves, you are able to see mm. them right up in front of your eyes. And that is what you're seeing here. And if you are to look at the rock formation itself, Ooh. it's like somebody took his time to, to arrange nicely chisel them nicely it's like really that. Good. But that's nature. But when you come in the high water level season, mm. which starts from the month of uh, January, February, March, April, May, and June, June. you will not see any in of rock. this rock formation. You only see the sprays that are going mm. up in the sky, which you are able to see 35 kilometers away, which is amazing as well. Yeah. And so because of these values, this is why this property is unique. And for anyone, like even yourself, mm. come now, you see this unique rock formation, awesome. but come in April and uh, May, that's when the waterfall are at its peak, you'll not be able to see anything. Yes. Imagine 500 million liters per minute falling per second, here, falling here, it's not a job. Sure. But in the dry season like this, it's only about 20,000 liters falling. Per minute. Before I go, mm -hmm. I want to know the local name for the Victoria Falls. It has got several local names, but the outstanding one is known as Musi Otunya, meaning, meaning the smoke that thunders. Look behind me! Is that not water falling? It's about time to tell your own story because it's only you who can be the right ambassador for your continent. Because these people are not ready to share the right information about Mother Africa. I know for sure that they always want the downfall of this continent. So they keep on pushing the negative image about Mother Africa, making people scared of coming to the motherland. This is the Victoria Falls and it's just beautiful. 
I'm amazed to see this for the first time. I nearly abort the mission of coming here because I nearly believe in the lies of Sky News. The Victoria Falls is not dead. As you can see, it's still alive. During the low water season like now, you are able to see the rock formation. Unique rock formation that you never see anywhere in the world. During the high season, I invite you to come again in April, May, and you see beautiful sprays rising up into the skies of this land. And unique rainbows as well are formed during the day and even in the night. Come and see the Victoria Falls. It's alive.